Am I the asshole? For making my nephew cry on his birthday party over some gifts. My F26 sister F29 has a son Eric, he's 8 years old. I don't visit a lot, we live away, but I see them and most of my family at birthdays and holidays. When I visit I usually buy Eric a toy or some candy, as he's my only nephew. TBH I like to spoil him and maybe I am a little bit to blame for what happened too. It was Eric's birthday this week. I visited them and I brought him a nice car toy, the car was quite big and had lights and stuff. When I got to the party I wished him a happy birthday and handed him the gift. He opened and he loved it, he said so far this is the best one, which at the time I thought he was just excited but with what happened later I kinda get the idea it was more malicious intended. Like an hour or so after the party started, when everyone had already arrived, Eric made an announcement to the table in which the adults were sitting. He said that I have won and that I was now the person who he loved the most because my gift was the one he liked the most. I thought it was sweet that he liked it. Then he told to my mom that her gift sucked she brought him a board game so he didn't love her anymore. He also told one of his friends that next year he won't be invited because his gift was poor he gifted him a set of dinosaurs figures. I think this whole thing of ranking the gifts people got them was pretty shitty, I expected my sister or her husband to say something, but they didn't, they just laughed. So I told Eric that he's not supposed to say that about his gifts, people get them what they can and he should be grateful with it. He said that he doesn't understand why he has to love people who doesn't buy him nice gifts. I genuinely can't believe my sister is teaching this bullshit to her son. His dad told him yeah, they should give you all the best. So I then again told him that a person's worth is not about how expensive or big the gift they got him was, and that if he thought that way then I will not be continuing buying him gifts. Eric started to cry. My sister told me off because I made him cry but most of my family and some of her in-laws were on my side and told them it was bad to teach their kids such thing. Our mom was quite affected and I wanted to leave too, so we left after that. My sister texted me later to call me an asshole for leaving before the candles were blow and for telling her child he won't get any more gifts from me, she said I shouldn't make empty threats to a child. I said that it's not empty and it's not a threat, it's a promise until they teach their kids some manners. Am I wrong for discussing this when my nephew was present? Am I being unreasonable to him since he's young? And would I be wrong in the future if I keep my promise and do not buy him a gift the next time we see each other? Not the asshole. What he did was incredibly rude and hurtful, especially when he said one of his friends wouldn't be invited again. I don't care he is 8 the other kid was probably around the same age. I'm glad you're not enabling him. It's great if you buy people gifts I'm a gift giver but it's one way of showing love and it's not a reason to be rude if the giver put effort into it. Not the asshole. Discipline, done correctly, is helpful and formative. This is one of those occasions. It's something he needed to hear. His parents treated it like it was a big joke and someone needed to tell him. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. At eight, he should know a little better how to say thank you as a matter of good manners. This is a parenting fail. And, if it continues, it's reinforcing a transactional way of thinking about relationships that will be very harmful to him in the long run. This is an issue of age-appropriate expectations. The parents should have taken the child aside and explained it to him. Taking his side, even as a joke, sends the wrong message. Your sister should be apologizing to everyone and working on manners. You were nice. My gift would have been coming with me. Not the asshole. Info is your nephew Dudley Dursley? Are his parents named Vernon and Petunia? Have you checked for a gaunt cousin under their stairs? Not the asshole that kid is lacking some discipline and common decency, the fact that the parents are making excuses for it is just awful, they're raising an entitled brat. Your nephew has learnt a valuable lesson, if he treats people poorly then there will be consequences, good on you for teaching him this when his parents could not. Not the asshole. In this case, 
you didn't overstep. His parents clearly aren't teaching him any morals or manners, in fact quite the opposite. They are raising him to be a monster. Keep your promise. If your nephew approaches you about it, talk with him calmly and explain why. It is possible you can be an influence for good in his life. If he changes his attitude, then resume buying him gifts. Not the asshole. There are some topics where relatives, friends, acquaintances, etc. shouldn't overstep because it's none of their business and doesn't affect them. This isn't one of them. He's treating people poorly, making other relatives and peers feel bad about themselves, etc. It would be concerning if you didn't say anything and ate up the praise from an eight-year-old. Not the asshole. What am appalling thing for him to say? Even at eight, he should know better, and it's pretty clear who's been teaching him that nonsense. You responded considerably more calmly than I would have, and I commend you. Not the asshole. I fail to see how anyone on here will be able to spin a story where you are the are in any way. You are better at parenting than his parents can ever aspire to be, lol. Keep working on making your nephew a good person. Not the asshole his parents remind me of the parents from Charlie and He Chocolate Factory. They are creating an entitled brat. Not the asshole. A lack of gratefulness is a sour trait to have and his parents are clearly teaching him this and enabling this behavior. You addressed this with him in a respectful, age-appropriate way and your sister calling you an asshole clearly shows she has taught this behavior. You have no obligation to continue buying gifts for a child who hasn't been taught gratefulness, hopeful this will teach him a lesson that his parents fail to. Not the asshole I'm astounded at those parents. Not the asshole you said the right thing, but it should have been the parents who said it. That being said, your problem should be more with the parents than the kid. Not the asshole. If this isn't corrected, this kid will grow up to be a nightmare. Not the asshole. What the hell? Someday this kid will hurt people if Jer doesn't get his way with the attitude they're teaching him. Info is your nephew Dudley Dursley? Not the asshole your nephew will remember your advice, and hopefully be grateful in the future. I would have stayed for the cake though, he's still just a kid. It's a shame his parents didn't stop his gift ranking, so good that you did next year give him a card and twenty dollars. Your nephew did what now? I go with not the asshole, because as a family member I'd be sad too or as one of his friends. Not the asshole. Aunt of the year. Man, my sister nearly passed out from shock and embarrassment when my nibbling specifically came over to where we were sat to inform me how they liked takeaway from McDee's better because they got to I dropped up with takeaway from elsewhere. I think she said incorrect. Tanta didn't have to bring us anything and we show appreciation rather than being greedy. Your nephew is a pupy goblin and you are doing the minimum to illustrate how you won't tolerate it. Edited for vote not the asshole. Oh god, of course not the asshole. I'm tired of this suppy of but he is just a kid guess what people? Kids can be cruel and bullies, and if you don't teach them manners, life will and it might not be pretty.